Hey guys, what's up? It's iJevin. How is everybody doing? Welcome back to another episode of FTB on the Hermitcraft server. Guys, it's a hot dog, but it's also a hat. That's right. It's a hot dog hat! Alright guys, so today we are removing our reactor. Uh, as much as I want to keep this reactor, I just, I can't do it. We need that middle tunnel to, um make ourselves uh like your power lines and stuff i need to run cable i've got to run ae cable the whole quantum thing just not working out i actually got it to work it took a little bit of coercing you had to name the uh the guys and then it and you had to give it like tons of power to make it run um okay okay that thing's gone forever all right so i was just collecting up this enderum so i could get the rest of this removed so what i'm probably going to do um is actually you know what i was actually i've never messed with uh the uh, the portals before but i saw hypno was using portals at his base um i don't know if you can custom shape those or not but they were pretty awesome i i don't think they can probably be custom shaped but uh it would be worth it um so the game plan here is to remove this and then put a shaft going up the middle where we can run all of our wires and everything. Uh, I'll probably remove this as our processing center because we're probably going to need to make a power plant up here. Um, and then we'll either make a processing area somewhere else or do something. Because we've got all this reactor stuff, we can definitely use it as a power plant. Um, so uh, The only thing I, uh, I am not sure about how I'm going to handle is how I'm going to get the wires out of the middle. Now, I can always come up to the top and just run my wires back into the place, but the, those will be a little bit viewable from the top, and I'm not sure that I want to do that just yet. So, a little bit of work to be done still. Um, once that's gone, I'm going to remove all this and start working on my tower. Right, guys, so I am back. I have been working on getting the tower removed. Uh, I've got a little bit of power going to the system, just not enough yet. Uh, so what I'm going to do next is I'm probably going to start setting up our reactors up here, but I think it's going to be uneven. I'm not sure. Um, here. The only, uh, actually, you know what? I think what I could do is just make them 6x5 and then use two reactor cores, like uh, chambers. So we'll put, a, put, we'll run four reactors on this level, um, and we will auto put them in and out. Uh, just like so. So let me get rid of all this and we'll build one reactor and then probably I don't know if I have enough cable to reach down there We'll see. I'm pretty sure I will But I'm thinking something like that probably so let's go ahead and build this guy and we'll end up doing probably four of these in the end and uh, I'm trying to decide on how I want to uh, Get the items inside of the reactor Let's see so if we have the tower coming up, we might need like four branch off pillars. And if we do it like that, then we could probably get stuff to go into it. I don't see it being that difficult. Um, I'm going to actually make this the size of this guy. Um, but yeah, the uh, the only thing we're, we're going to have trouble with is trying to get uh, items in and out. Uh, before we could just go top or bottom and make it work. You know what I'm thinking about doing? I'm thinking about putting like uh, a couple extra levels on top and bottom of each one. Or maybe just on top to get the cables in. Um, I know it would make it uneven from the bottom. But if we put extra levels on, on here and just made it taller or something. We could make it work, definitely. I don't know yet, we'll see. I don't know. I'm just. I was just trying to think of ways to like make this work. I didn't really account for wiring. I thought I was gonna try to do everything wirelessly. That's why I'm having so many problems now with it. All right. So let me get this built because this should provide more than enough power, and we're gonna have four of these running at all times. So get all this place. Kidoki. Man, yeah, I, I've been so addicted to vanilla Minecraft lately. I've just been playing on Hermitcraft like a ton. Uh, you. You, you. I don't know. I probably have enough glass to fill this whole thing up. Now, where are we going to put everything we need for this? Um, 
we need to decide. There's a couple things we need to figure out. Um, you know what I think I might do? I think I might use the Ender IO cable and just run bundles of cable and like run it past here, you know? That could work. I could put, um, let's see. Actually, the only thing I'm not sure about with the Ender IO cable is if I can, uh, we'll have to test it. But if we, we put a power tap here and a power tap there, or a power, uh, hold on, where's the power tap at? Did I just have it in my hand? Power tap, yeah. There we go. Uh, then we put the controller there. We could run the bundles of cable around the inside of this frame like this. And we could be able to control the whole thing with under I.O. cable. And we just use the M ME conduit. That could totally work. Okay. So I just need to... I think that's everything I need besides the... Oh, I gotta put the... Uh, control rod in there oh I didn't think about that I don't have another control rod so we can only put one control rod in there right now but that'll be fine when I uh, when I get more out when I can get back into my system I should say I'll put more in there all right let's glass it up and put some uh, liquid in here to keep it from exploderizing and I want to test that any conduit out I think it's gonna be a good idea to use that though and plus, we'll have four reactors running, so it'll be super solid. There we go. And we just need to fill this in. Uh, why did that not make a full block? Oh, we're missing a spot up there. Right there. Um, here, I'm actually going to... Remove some of this real fast. I okay. I've got to get into my ender chest. Grab all you. Okay. So ender chest. Um, the resonant uh, ender is like way a way better coolant than um, the other stuff. So. There we go. Did I put that too high? Oh, crap. Failure. All right, so let me put it, put it down there instead. Then we'll buck, button this thing back up. And I, oh, no, 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 no. I love how those items like do that when they, there we go. And we'll grab you. Alright, that should be just enough to get us uh, started. There we go. Let's just make sure that this thing is not going to like go all the way up. Yeah, it's producing power rather quick. Alright, awesome. So now I can hook this cable back up um, down to my system. And uh, I'm going to grab a bunch of uh, conduit. And I think what we're going to do is we're just going to make a conduit bundle. And what that means is I'm going to run item conduit, I'm going to run energy conduit, and I'm going to run ME conduit uh, all in one bundle all the way around the base. That way we can have uh, anything we need within like a touch of barely using it, you know. So that should give us enough power to actually use our system again. Really, no? Maybe I need to touch the controller directly. There we go. There we go. Alright, so I'm going to work on this some. I'll be back in just a little bit. Hey right, guys, so... I have got um, this set up with using, excuse me, using Emmy Conduit, uh, these guys right here with the uh, with the Ender I.O. cable. And I've got it pumping in, extracting out, and it's working just fine. The only thing I don't like is the cable showing. I was thinking about maybe moving something on top. Um, like I said, I could add another layer to the top layer and make it like a cable layer. 
Um, but if I do that, I'm going to have to do it on all of the sides. I would have to add two on the bottom, two on the top, two on the bottom, two on the top, and make it thicker. Um, which, you know, isn't such a bad thing. I could totally, I could totally do it. Um, I don't know. I just don't know if I want to do that, you know? Because it's going to make it look a lot bulkier. And not to mention, like, it's going to take a ton of material to do it, so. Um, I'm still trying to figure out a way to really hide that cable. Obviously, I could go on top with it. Um, or on bottom with it. I guess for this case, it would be better if it went on top, though. Uh, just because it would be hidden more. But for now, at least we have power running, and it's working. And I was just thinking, I could, I could leave the controller here. Then... I could um, just put uh, put all the other stuff right up here and do it from there. That could work. Um, I'm trying to think about how I'm going to like make all this work. I don't know. It's just like I need to find a way to make this like all be almost not like wireless, but hide the cables well enough to where to work. Now I was thinking I could use a paint machine. But with the blocks that I have chosen, let me grab the paint machine. With the blocks that I have chosen, I'm not sure that it's gonna work. Uh, is it conduit? Yeah, I wanna make this guy right here. Do I have that? Grab you. And let me uh, go up here. So we'll paint one of these blocks and see how that looks real fast. Um, let's throw that on the ground. My inventory is like super full right now. Uh, you, you. Okay. Now, if it can hide this, that could change things. I could just seal off each layer. and But you know what I think it's going to do? Oh my goodness. I did not know it was going to do that. I thought for sure it was going to have a border around it. That changes pretty much everything. Uh, okay. So what I think I'm going to do... I wonder if it'll do the same for this. I wonder if that would look... Um, like crooked or whatever. Let's let's do that real fast. Let me, you. Know, I've got to, I've got to see now. I'm gonna see if it's gonna connect to it or not. Cause that is a connected texture. So is the other one. To be fair, but you. Know, I'm so curious. Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh baby that is wonderful so what i think i'm gonna do is i think i'm gonna seal off each layer and we'll either use elevators to get up and down and uh hide the cable in the walls now i can pretty much hide everything i'm just gonna figure out i like i said i wanted to put a portal in so where i could get up and down but i don't know there's got to be a better way to get up and down this thing you know um, that would be my, uh, now that we've figured out how to, uh, hide all the cable, that would be my next challenge would be trying to figure out, uh, a way to fly up and down. Because if we're going to block these off, then, um, I'm not sure. Also, uh, if we're going to block it off, how should we block it off? Should we, huh, I don't know. I don't think you can do invisible conduit, can you? There's no way to do that. I wish there was. Like, make an invisible block. Huh. I don't know. I'm going to figure it out, though. All right, guys. I finally decided how I was going to do this. So, first off, I made the, uh, the, the center part smaller. Then, I decided to put these, like, little branch-offs every time we hit a barrier. So, when we come up, we have them up here as well. So, I can use the straight paths here to get over to here and then when we hit this spot we'll just come up and run our cable over uh i think it's going to be the best way to do it i've also installed another reactor so um right now what we need to do is we need to move some stuff over so what i'm going to do is i'm going to start with this one because i haven't really did anything with this yet um do i have i have reactor casings okay good so i need to take this guy I need to take this guy, and I need to take this guy. I should have put glass there, actually. Let me remove these and put glass in. There we go. 
there we go and so we're gonna go up top and remove the snow and so we've got three blocks we need to put in right here right here and right here and so let's see we'll do you you and you now do i have i don't have what i need on me all right so we've got to grab some stuff here we gotta grab some cable do i have any other cable left over no i right, we need import bus export bus um we have energy conduit on us then we're going to need you which we already have and you that should take care of that all right so once the once the me conduit comes out right here uh we'll be able to hook up uh our cable just like so so it'll hook up right here and right here once it pops out um technically speaking we should probably have it come up out of the ground actually all right, so then we'll run you here, and import bus. The server is like really, really laggy today. I don't know why, it's weird. Uh, export bus there, and then energy conduit there. And then everything will be connected to this and it'll all touch and we'll just do that and so then all we would have to do is just put you here put you there and so what i need to do now is i need to get uh so we've already got our cable running up this far let's see we can go all the way up run it around then we'll need to make some paint blocks uh i need more actual emmy cable we're gonna need emmy conduit and emmy cable so let's go grab that real fast i'll probably have to make some uh, clear emmy conduit actually i might actually have some of that we have two grab some of that and then i'll, I'll make some as well which i don't see it emmy conduit that will be enough. Then we need any cable. Uh, cable, which is you, you. That should be enough. Awesome. And we're going to need. Uh, where did I put it? It might be up top still there. Do I don't think I have it on me? In the painting machine. Okay. We're going to need the conduit this stuff how much of that do i have 90 all right seven should be enough awesome so let me put we'll do the paint machine first paint machine go there and we want to paint one of those uh, so we'll do that and in the meantime let's uh, I guess we don't technically need to uh, yeah we actually will need to remove these here let me go ahead and get rid of that so let's see one two three so that'd be four five all right so we'll take you and get you out of there put you in there Put you there, okay. Put you there, and uh, let's start running the cable. So let's run our other cable up over here. So this is much more hidden. I like this a lot better, to be honest with you. Go to probably right there. Yeah, that'll work. Uh, me conduit. Crap. I hate how it's it's, it's so laggy. I don't know why it keeps doing that for. Ah, I'm falling. So we'll go... And then we'll go there. So that should all be connected. 
Grab you. And nothing ever happens. Uh, we need to bring this up. We should be good to go. Or not. Oh, you know what? I think the reactor might need to be turned on. Okay. Filling up. Can I access this, please? So much lag. The lag is real, man. Why won't it let me access that? What in the world? I guess I'll relag real or relag. I'll relog real fast. So, game. Hello, anybody there? Um, alright. For some reason, it will not let me access that. Why is that green for? I have no idea. I can't, I can't get in there. Did I make a wrong port? Cool import. I think that's the wrong port. Hold on. Cool imports, access port. Uh, ports. Oh, yeah, no wonder. That's definitely the wrong port. I was like, why won't it let me access that? The, the game is obviously broken. I mean, you. And you. 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 No, I haven't seen anything come out of it yet. We probably need to reactivate the reactor. Yeah. There we go. I wish I could put these in there. <laughs> that would be awesome. As long as we don't see it building up, it should be fine. So I just need to do this for all four sides. I'm perfectly okay with that showing. And I, I'm happy with the way this looks because then it, it not only does it give it a little bit of style, it's actually it actually doesn't look too bad, and we can hide all of our cable that we need inside that middle port there. So uh, this actually works out fairly well for what we're doing. All right, guys. So that's gonna do it for today's episode. Uh, I've got all four of our reactors up and running. I just need to connect all the cables. I just keep running out of material. Uh, but for the most part, I would say this floor is pretty much finished. I'm going to get everything for the rest of this done um, <clears throat> off camera. And when we come back next time, we are definitely going to work on some new stuff. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, don't forget to hit that like button as always. This is iGem. Peace.